Team 15 starts from MOC. Oh, I can't even do this until new MOC comes out. I guess that's two weeks later. God damn, I'm still. Questioning if I should get E2, but it's just impossible actually. 94 rolls. 94 rolls possible to get E2. No, it's not, not possible. God damn it, would all my friends have E2? Like, like this guy, he literally says he had zero rolls, but he still got E2. Like, what the hell happened to zero rolls? My guy still has an E2. <laughs> what the hell? I'm the only one that doesn't have E2. It feels like that. Yet, every single Agaron haver has E2. I don't understand. Yep. Oh, this guy doesn't. Well, he has the E1 for some reason. Oh, okay. This, this person is free to play. Okay. Oh, Belt does not have E2. E1, are you on me? Okay, that's not bad. I remember E1. Hall Hall was pretty good. Yeah, it's okay. Because it adds an extra turn for the skill. And that's pretty insane, I feel like. Plus the 12% speed, it's like a huge buff. Huge quality of life buff. Yeah, I really want to work on uh, a limited 5 star at a lot one day. But I don't know. It can't be Aventurine and it can't be Robin. Because I'm not, not too much of a fan of Robin's design. She is a bit on the bland side. Maybe Firefly is the play. I gotta become a Firefly main. Okay. What should I use up the rest of my stamina on? Probably tr Traces, yeah, yeah. There's a lot of characters I gotta upgrade the traces. I need to upgrade my whole hall's ultimate because I know it actually makes a pretty big deal. How much do I need? I need uh, around 20 of the purple flowers. Damn, that's a lot. What else? Oh yeah, and also this. Four more of these purple blades. Four more purple blades. I want to upgrade her skill to max because it gives more crit rate. And then also her talent for more damage reduction. 2% more, so 18% damage reduction total. All of Fushuan's traces are pretty good to upgrade, actually. Yeah, they're all really good traces, holy cow. Just need to get this one up. What's up, Yen? 
I'm just uh, figuring out what to do with the rest of my stamina. Oh yeah, I have so many of these. I'm just gonna maybe clear out the chesses in Panacani because I've never I never really finished them. I want to max out my whole horse ultimate and probably her talent. Yeah, her ultimate and talent is what I want to max out. I guess I might as well use the rest of the stamina here. Right? They're gonna double, apparently they're gonna double the drop rate for the relics during the 10th or the 16th, I forgot. Well, that's like a long time later. I think the 10th. And I'll just start grinding more relics then. I still don't understand why the voice lines are gone though. My game is bugged or something? For some reason it's bugged. <laughs> voice... Maybe if I do this... And then pull it back? Still nothing happens. Uh, sound effects, I don't think that's it. Craft one upgrade ultimate. Nice. And I just need forty more. <laughs> Twelve more. Twelve more. All right, I get around three per run, so I just need to do four more runs. These, and then after this, I'll probably finish up my Claro's trace too. Gotta work on them one day. Can't just keep leaving them at low level traces. And maybe after I finish all the traces, I'll think about grinding for either future characters or a Himiko. Because I'm pretty sure I'm gonna get a Himiko soon. The next time I get a standard pity, I guess. Which actually might be a long time. Damn, I wish I had Argent. He must have all crap. I didn't even get one. Well, that's not good.
apparently the stuff we find here lets you craft the uh, technique point stuff. Oh hi Aiden. What's up? Yeah, I'm just grinding some stuff. Might as well clear them all out for the materials. Okay. Still got 35 stamina, but whatever. I'll just save it for some other time. I wanna clear out the map. Finish these. Oh wait, I'm missing one here. Golden edge, I'm also missing one here. I don't even know that where that one chest is. So hard to find. Wait, what is this? Didn't I finish this? Check, 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 check. Yeah, finish this. Finish this. <coughs> I, I want to finish this one off. Oh, there's a lot, still a lot to do here. I wanna explore all the area. I don't think there's anything here. Oh, there's a dog here. I don't even know what those dog things are for. This is nothing here. Trash can. Join the table. Oh, whoops. Oh, I dodged it. Well, how come it doesn't let me fight the... Alright, whatever. Let's battle it. I wish I had E2 Acheron. Man, if I had E2 Acheron, I would just put on an utility and I'm set. But nope, I don't. Kinda still does a lot of damage even without E2, but it's like I could do more though if I had E2. Ok, 
can't relate. <laughs> yeah, I swear everyone has E2. Bro, that's some bullshit. How does everyone have E2? Maybe when Sam becomes more OP, I'm gonna show off my E2 Sam instead. At E2, she does the double. Yeah, basically, she does do double because the exponential increase of damage from that 45% buff. I guess I might as well complete this puzzle area. I've never done it before. Two bubble charges. How do I upgrade? Go up there. You'll go for Sam Edelons too. He won't be as OP as Zach. Bro, I'm pretty sure he's gonna be more OP than Necron. Fire? I mean, there's no way fire is not OP. Unless they make it wins. Man, because if you think about it, fire is the only element we need. We ever need. We're always only missing fire. Because my shitty ass Topaz isn't doing her job in pure fiction. They go by lore. I mean by lore then Boot Hill is as strong as Akron, right? Or maybe not. There's no way they go by lore. Because uh, wealth is dog shit. What the hell? They just TP'd me out. Well, the standard. I mean, what about Jing Yuan? <laughs> the guy is literally the chosen one of the Sienjo. Ooh, more chesses. Wow. Feels definitely weaker. Oh no, I've seen the videos on YouTube and he does not look weak. He actually looks like he does the same amount of damage as Akron. No one's close to Akron except both. Oh, you mean lore? Boot Hill? <clears throat> They're both galaxy rangers. I guess the thing about Akron is that she comes from a different universe too, and she doesn't know her past. That's why she's OP as hell. She's literally the lightning god, basically. Oh yeah, I forgot. March is coming out. Apparently they they talked about March. I forgot about that one. 
she better be a good AoE unit. How do I get up there? She's free? There's no way she's free. Gonna make it like Don Hung. Path change like MC. Yeah, Don Hung used to be Hunt and he changed into Destruction. Marsha's Preservation. She's probably gonna change into Hunt, right? I heard. I mean, I'm guessing she's probably gonna be like some sort of machine gun arrow person. Came from this way. It won't be like in Vibrator Lune. But it has to be like a Vibrator Lune. Alright. Unless they refresh the room again, just keep refreshing it. Did your sleep schedule is worsening day by day? It should, <laughs> should fix it, maybe. Somehow, I mean, for me, I never have trouble sleeping. When I sleep, I just sleep. I could change my sleep schedule anytime I want. As long as I want to sleep, I can sleep forever. can't sleep so you try to stay up until you can't pretty sure everyone has like a special technique of sleeping right you could uh like I don't know maybe watch like some boring video 
and I'll guarantee you to sleep. Or like read some boring manga. Oh, it's this thing. Damn, I hate this thing. This thing is so annoying to do. Alright, what do I have to do? Kill that stuff. Oh crap. Okay, that was not the play. Can be 12 in the noon if you're in a vehicle, you're gonna fall asleep. Yeah, I think cars are easy to sleep in for some reason. What do I have to do here? Go in here. I have one bullet. I think I'm supposed to kill these guys somehow. Biological filler skips. This is dumb. Crap, I need more bullets. I think I was supposed to kill these guys first. Alright, let me just suicide. Oh my. Alright, let me suicide again. Okay, the play was to. Trick them all into the corner. Where's my ammo at? Still don't have any ammo. Hit the mobs to get the ammo back. Yeah, but I don't have a single piece. Where is my single piece of ammo? Oh damn it! I wasted it. I'm trying to get back to the beginning to get the ammo back, but they're not letting me. Isn't there like a restart button? No, there's no restart button. Damn. I guess I just have to patiently wait. I hate waiting. Rejoin game. Right, I got out though, so we're good. What I gotta do is kill these two at the same time. Kill that one. Kill those. Pretty sure the achievement to getting full ammo, but I didn't get it. Cause I didn't reach full ammo. Which is unlucky. Oh, I could get full ammo here, okay. Yeah, full ammo. Did you see the Wuthering Waste trailer? Oh, I haven't yet. If they have a new one. I'll, I'll check it out. Oh no, they kind of, I feel like they rushed the game. It's kind of uh 
lame how they rushed the game. Like, they still have a lot to fix. Have you seen the pom pom special? No. Well, let me check it out right now. Oh shoot, whoops, wrong thing. I opened Valorant instead of Opera GX. And they have like the similar red lines. So I thought Valorant was Opera. <laughs> yeah. I hate Opera GX's opening thing, it's so. it always makes a sound. HSR Palm Palm. Oh, I opened it, but I didn't watch the full thing. Because I knew it was like some sort of April Fool's thing, so I didn't watch the full thing. Uh, let me fix the screen. Oh, it's already good. Watch it from the start. Some Power Ranger thing. Oh, Moo, I've never even seen this character in Star Wars yet. I didn't even know it exists. We have to deploy the oh, weapon. So the Hunk city's defenses cool. won't hold much longer. No, it's too dangerous. It hasn't passed the last round of testing yet. Then blast that thing with all our firepower. The imaginary intrakinetic portable tactical laser cannon is still charging. There's no time to evacuate the city. We're done for. What should we do? Everyone, stay calm and do what you can. Pom Pom will buy you some time. Pom Pom. Pom pom, so cute. <laughs> the road ends here, Homu. Pom pom, putting a stop to this. <laughs> oh, 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 oh. Pom pom. <laughs> yeah, oh, oh, oh. Why use Please, your yeah. whip? No choice. Fire it up. Oh no. no. Ultimate decisive battle weapon activated. No. Oh, the transforms him. <laughs> Ultimate Primus? I tried to blast him with his ass, but throws him in time. Bananas? What the heck? What the heck kind of attack is that? <laughs> Where does bananas come from? Pom Pom still got wrecked. Come, not coming soon. Oh, yeah, we got scams. Let me watch the. 
watering wait this one three days ago one of the Thranodians will soon be reawakened they are the enemies of human civilizations to begin with I heard you've lost your memories if all of these have something to do with your true identity then who exactly are you? Moreover, you possess a similar ability with the legendary hero who once absorbed Thronomian. Joy prophesied about your arrival. After all this effort, do you truly want to throw it all away? Ultimately, I suppose it is up to you to discover the final definitive answer for yourself. No matter what happens, my soul well, it's kind is of bitch. The trailer is a bit bitch. Besides, not seeing the opponent heightens Man, the I really want that character though. But I never got her. Rule setting shepherd or the rule breaking black lab. Now, Rover, the story is yours to spin. It's kind of bitch. I don't think it's that well made. <clears throat> Could be better. Oh, whoops. People in the Japan community are only talking about the parkour function in Modern Waves. Parkour is extremely buggy. Hopefully, they fixed it. <laughs> Supposed to go. Nope. Every review is you said it's the only good thing ever. Yeah, it, honestly, uh, I'll just. There's not really much going for it. It's, it's just being over hearts right now. And any sort of thing that's being said about it, people just try to cancel you so hard too. Like, I don't understand why these players want a new, a game that has like some sort of hack and slash. To it so much like Genshin has that. Oh crap, this quick. The Genshin killer. I mean, they're saying that it's not a Genshin killer because it's a different game. But <laughs> no offense, but it's the same game. It's not a different game. I don't know what they're talking about. Different game. I mean, sure, you don't use elemental systems, but it's relatively the same. Attack and slash, still. I mean, like, there's these people that say it's a completely different game and you're not supposed to compare it. That's like. I feel like those people. They are trolling. Like, how is it a completely different game? If you show it to some guy that has never played Genshin before, you probably think it's Genshin. But nah, it's, it's just those people fetishizing 
that it's a unique game. It's like, it's not unique. We had so many games that are like that. It's Honkai Impact. And also the PGR, which made that new one. But it's like, wow, these people are going crazy just to feel like they have like a new game to play. They just want to act special, I guess. They're like, oh, Genshin is too easy. We need a hardcore game. <laughs> Why not just play a skill based game then? Why do you still play a game based on gotcha if they want a skill based game? <laughs> Have you seen the Elden Ring DLC? Yeah, I saw it. It's pretty cool. I haven't even finished the base game yet because I was playing it with my sister and her boyfriend and Bro, I, I freaking hate playing with them because every time I play with them Like they they already played like 200 hours of it, so they already finished the game But they decided to play with me and all they do is freaking kill all the bosses for me in one hit Because they have these OP mage builds that just one shot everything and I can't even play myself and now I, I kind of like, I don't even know what part I'm up to. I might as well restart the game. Wait, what am I doing? Play got spilled and suffer. Yeah, I just want to do like some sort of heavy sword build or something. What the heck? I need an upgrade thing. I much rather play that other game though. Duet Night of This. It was pretty fun because. Oh, there's not much, of, nothing special about it, but the fact that we get to use guns makes it fun. And there's co-op. Well, I guess there's also co-op in the, wasn't waves too, but like, it's the same old stuff. About to do the skin. Finished Elden Ring in the first week when it came out and never touched it again. I want to play again. The thing is that I have to start from scratch. But what am I even doing here? Is it like a secret? No secret. I'm stuck. I don't know what to do. Oh wait, no. I have three charges now. So I just go back and that should be easy. And I want to play that a zero pro million game because that is Pokemon. What the hell? 
It's nothing new. What? Well, I don't get this puzzle. I don't see anything I could collect. finished it. 20 do we out of 24? Yeah, probably finished it. Let me take a look. I don't see any single chest in this room. Oh, and the NPC is gone too, so I guess I finished. Alright, this room is done. I just need to go to the right side now. Unless there's any secret chest in here. No. See any chess? Finished this area already, too. But what else did I not finish? I don't understand. I'm pretty sure I finished this area too. You haven't finished it yet? No, but I already- I remember I entered here. This was where, uh... I entered with Aventurine or something. Or, uh, Dr. Ratio. Cause there's supposed to be like a treasure in the middle, but, uh, it's gone. Puzzle doesn't count. We can still do it. Or do what? The puzzle? I don't see anything I have to do here. Dude in the room we just walked into holding the picture. Oh. Alright. This guy. Oh. I didn't even see him. Ah, uh, okay. But I think that should be it. Because I remember I already did the Hanu puzzle. I don't think there's anything down here either. That's it, okay. Maybe I should kill these guys too. No, that's useless. Alright, done with here. Uh, well, for some reason that, that that doesn't even count as one of the things. I'm missing two tresses, one trotter, and one trash can. I'm guessing they're all over here. 
But what does this count as? Do I do you like Avalon? So they're all somewhere here, I'm guessing. City chest here. The koi. Sad. Locate Mr. McCoy's brother. Okay. What's up there? My elbows are so itchy. I don't know why. I've it's probably because they're so ashy. I need to get my elbows fixed or something. Cause for some reason the ashy spot is like growing and that's like not good. Oh, this is his brother? Oh, we're gonna kill his brother, okay. Double harmony instead of double nihility? Because <laughs> cause I don't have a good nihility to use. Other than Pela, I don't want to use my vault, he sucks ass. So I might as well go zero nihility at that point. It's like, why would I sacrifice my OP harmony for some dog shit ass nihility? Because I'm not even going to go for double nihility, so there's no point of doing single nihility if I have... I don't even have double nihility, right? Walt sustain? He, he barely sustains. My Walt does not sustain at all. Why not eat sweet and sour? I 
I'm sure my double harmony works, right? They provide enough buffs to make it work. Well, sustain is kind of overrated because you don't you need to use skill points. Yeah, you kind of do need to use skill points if you want to use your ulti. But I, I'm guessing if you have enough uh, of his Adelons, he starts ulting like every two turns, but I don't have his Adelons. Or a good weapon for him to even make it worth. Oh, I haven't even explored this place yet. What have I missed out? It has to be a bird here. Right? There's no way there's no birdie. What the hell? Requirement 170 speed for 2 ulti spin. Yeah, I don't think I'll be reaching that anytime soon. Every speed piece combined. Yeah, I don't have any good speed pieces myself, so. I don't think I could get my Walt sustain up. Has to be a bird somewhere near. Let's get good artifacts. I'm trying my best to farm better artifacts. Alright, I think I did everything in this place. 23 out of 27. But I haven't even unlocked this thing. Oh, there's a. It's a garbage can. Is this even supposed to happen? Yeah, I thought we could always hit the trash can again. Yes, we can. Why to let them hit us? Okay, so after checking out Robin, I kind of want to skip Aventure now. Because Robin's powerful, really powerful. She's a better version of Yuan Mei, and Yuan Mei is probably still one of the highest value characters to roll for. So that means Robin must be one of the highest values to roll for. Especially since I have a follow-up team. Okay, one down, three more to go. Has to be a chest here. How can I not see a chest? I'm guessing this one is for 
What, what is this for? Rage fire characters? Okay, so this is for Firefly. We're gonna have to farm this for Firefly. Or the other girl called Katarina. I can't believe there's no chess here. Where else could be a chess? Take out Topaz? Oh yeah, I forgot. But I wanna use my... My Akron. Come on, Piggy, do your work. Piggy. Oh, there's a bird here. I didn't even see. Okay. I don't think these chests are connected, are they? With the other area? Clock? Oh, okay, that's yeah, it's totally different. Okay. I guess if they're not here, they're probably still in the. this area. What? Oops. Maybe in the beginning? Oh, wait, let me speak to McCoy. Maybe he gives me two chests for free. gives me is a sticker. Oh, and a golden token. Okay. Okay, so where can the other chests be? I checked every single spot. Still missing two chesses and one warp trotter. Everyone's all sad. But happy. Oh, she gave me a sticker. Okay. Nothing. There's no chesses. Man, this one's tough.
maybe it's this area because I remember I was doing this area but the class kicked me out even before I finished. Wait no never mind I, I remember I completed this area for one. Be sure I did. Here. Oh, whoops. No, that's not aggro on. Okay, I go up here. And then there's nowhere else for me to even go. God damn. My Peggy is not helping me either. side The area I did 100%. Yeah, 100% I cleared this. the same place okay I don't see a single piece of chess pretty sure I cleared this too So bored of playing gacha, you should go back to playing old JRPGs for a bit. I don't even have any old games I could play other than some MMOs, maybe Lost Ark. But then I don't have anyone to play that game. God, my piggy isn't helping me. Chesses. Maybe they're inside here. That's the only place.
The North Star gets shut down though. It's still up. The only game that got shut down that I know of is probably Terra. Since that game is super old. Can that chest be? Oh, Peggy. Nice. Found a warp trotter. Now I only need two more things. The two chests is all I need. They're probably hidden somewhere here. Piggy back out. Oh wait, I haven't been here. Oh wait, no, this is literally where I came from. There's something back there, but I don't know how to make it work back there. It's this thing. Bottle of wine? How do I bring you a bottle of wine? There's a chest back there. Guarded by the dino. Oh, how do I even get there though? Like, I don't know how to. The bubble thing, I, I tried it before, I couldn't get it to work. Solo leveling game? Uh. There's nothing new in the solo leveling game. They haven't updated it forever. Wait, how do I do it? Do you get? Do you go from here? Rotate. But well, I don't see an option here. Unless. Go back. Okay. And then from here we we do this. I don't see any option here. The f turn the first one. Oh, wait, then what? Rotate. Oh shoot, okay, got it. Okay, nice. Yeah, 
Yeah, say you pulled one time and got you one Akron, yeah, then you might as well go for E2 if you're that lucky. I swear I'm never that lucky. Like, I've never gotten a character earlier than 60 holes. I don't understand. If I just won one character before 60, I feel like I would definitely be able to go for E2, but I never did. One chest on. Is there one more? No, there's no more. I just wait. What? That doesn't even count as a chest. Apparently, that one doesn't even count. I still need two more chests. Savings are just a number, E2 is much more. What the heck? What am I even missing? How is... How am I still missing two chesses? <laughs> okay, it can't be there, because I checked there. Yeah, they should just put all of them to count, I don't understand. Maybe there's some other spot that I don't know of. Yeah, they need to add like that Genshin map or something. Wait, where did I not go? I already went to these two places. Went over here. And I literally went through all of this area. But still, no. There's no way. Secret entrance, maybe? Maybe there's a Hanu thing that I missed out? Find the cards, no. Definitely not here. Dude hasn't gone outside in so long, he had to save up for an Akron, just go outside. How does going outside help me get an Akron? Yeah, if you mean to find a job, I have one, but I'm not gonna spend money in the video game. Oh, Acorn. I mean, I'd rather put the money into my savings so that I can buy another house and then until I get enough money from just uh, mortgaging my house or something I mean, uh, not mortgaging, uh, renting it out then maybe I'll start spending money in games Still no chess. Uh, 
I literally checked every single corner. Holy cow. How is that possible? I checked every single corner with my topaz too. So the piggy would alert me if anything. Look up a guide? Nah, but then if I look up a guide, it wouldn't tell me the thing I'm missing. It'll show me everything again. That would be bad. I just need two chesses apparently. Oh my god. I need maybe behind this cart? Oh no, I can't even go behind this cart. Is this a secret way? No. Alright, so it cannot be here because I literally looked at every single corner. I can't. My pig would indicate something if I did walk past anyways. So it can't be here, so it has to be... Uh, but it also can't be in these because I literally checked those three times. Maybe this person can bring me to a secret room? can this be? I did that Hanu thing already. For sure I did. Maybe I have to do it again. So what do you think about modern ways? Uh, I don't expect much from it. The fact that they're releasing the game so soon, even without, with all the bugs, and they did not optimize it for PC well, is a problem. Like the streamers, all the streamers that are playing it have like some insanely high end PC. So that that's like unrelatable. They have all these 40, 80 GPUs. I'm pretty sure most people don't even have 3080. And people are already lagging even with the 4080s, so... How is a regular player ever gonna play the game? They have to release it this year, or else they lose the license or something? Oh yeah, I guess. There's so much stuff they have to work on. Certain characters, like the characters are so unbalanced in the game too. Like there are just some characters that are just way better than the other characters. So there's no point of ever using these other characters when th those exist. Oh, where am I supposed to go? While doing ways is to try hard. <clears throat> no. I still think while doing ways is for casuals. I, mean, I never had to struggle in that game at all. In fact, I'm pretty sure I could use one hand to play that game. Did you play the end game? Yeah, basically the simulator is the end game. You just fight the bosses until and they just have higher HP. All you have to do is memorize the boss's attack thing, and then you just dodge. 
They just pay to win. And also another reason why I don't like the characters in uh, Wuthering Waves is that the freaking Edelons, they, they aren't special. Like, you know how in Star Rail, characters have Edelons where it changes their kit a bit? Like, there's these special effects and advancements, but in, uh, in Wuthering Waves, they don't really have these special effects. They only have, like, maybe get more energy or maybe do more damage. Like these types of buffs, which makes it boring. I want more special Edelons or constellation things. I'll tell you one non pay to win gotcha? Yeah, I don't think there's ever that, right? How do I even get to the Hanu thing? You could just skip all the try hard stuff for pay to win, yeah. And the fact that people. There's people that actually argue that just don't pay to win. But that's funny, because you could also do that in Genshin too, just don't pay to win. <laughs> just try to be Abyss without any good units, and that would be. S oh, oh no, I feel like that's a waste of time. <laughs> it's like their way of saying a game is hard is to waste time. That's the gameplay for them. PvP does make a game pay to win because most of the times PvP rewards are massive. And the difference in progress between a pay to win and a free to play is massive. Yeah. You agree you're saying about something else? Oh, okay. Oh my god, I was about to fire the missile. I was waiting for him to group up so I get like a big shot in. Oh, there's a chest here. Okay, got one of them down. All right. I just need one. Oh, there's one more chest. Nice. Good. I got them all now. Right? There's no way I'm still missing a chest. That's impossible. Yes, I got them all. So apparently they're just in here. I thought I did them, but it's probably because it was the story quest and they kicked me out before I entered this thing. Pay to convenience is pay to win. Yeah, as long as there's any sort of boost, I feel like it's pay to win. Because time is important. So if you're boosting, then that means you're paying to win. I finished this map, but now I just need seven chests from this map. That's like playing League of Legends. It's either you level an account to 30 to start ranking, or you buy accounts to level 30. You're boosting. You have topaz to clear everything easy is just not fun. Yeah. So you think pay to win in games like Star Wolf, no PvP is just waste money? I mean, this I don't think this game can have PvP. Anything with gotcha cannot have PvP. But if that means there's no skill base around it, and PvP is only skill base, or else. It's like kind of bullshit, it's like 
What's the point of playing PvP if it's not skill based? Based on luck? Yeah, it's too simple for PvP. And the instant this game has PvP, a lot of people will quit it. Because I know a lot of people, they'll quit a game and they'll pretend that it's not fun for them. When it's actually because they're not winning enough. <laughs> And that's another reason why I know a lot of people don't like League of Legends when they... Especially people that don't play games, they don't like the look of League of Legends at all because if you don't win, then you'll never feel the joy of PvP. I mean, the, the point of League of Legends is to outsmart someone. I mean, outplay them. So if they never win that, then it's, it's like, what are you doing in League? What the hell, I have to pay this guy? Alright, whatever. Skill issue, yeah. Ice cream. There are still some people that play League though. I don't know why. Like I, I actually did not know that there was a player group that plays League of Legends only for the bot mode. <laughs> That's just funny. Like how do people play bot in the PvP? <laughs> That's crazy. Like, I was talking to one guy that was playing League, and then he told me that he does not play the PvP aspect of League. <laughs> Man. The important part is to have fun. Yeah, but the whole point of League is strategy. And if you're playing against bots, then that means you don't have strategy. <laughs> That means you you just rather follow a pattern and not follow the strategy. I mean, not do any strategy. That's just sad, yeah. I mean, I guess they they didn't even want to play league. They, I feel like they their friends force them, and then they start pretending that they like it themselves when they don't actually like the game. There's gotta be more fun things to do, yeah. But I just don't understand how they force themselves to play League if they're not gonna play the PvP because that's the whole point of League. <laughs> play Aero at that point, yeah. Oh, friend there. And I was playing with this one person. He wanted to learn jungle roll. And I told him it was gonna be hard because if you're playing jungle, then that means the rest of the your teammates are gonna have to rely on you to carry. But that person does not know how to do shit. And that person is like, oh I practice in bots. And it's like what how how are you supposed to practice jungle in bots? Like there isn't even the enemy jungler in bots. <laughs> they literally let you AFK farm. How are you supposed to practice there? Like what the heck? <laughs> That's like oh we pra <laughs> They probably thought they practice how to right click. Wow. So impressive. I swear they're not made for League at that point, but it's their favorite game apparently. I kept on asking the person if they want to play it 
like some other co-op game, but nah, they they only want to play League. Play Hacker Room and just touch the enemy for assists. Nah, they just need to play. I kept on recommending Cartus. I just told them if you just play Cartus and you just press R whenever I tell you to, then then you'll be at least have impact in the game. But nah, they don't like Cartus. Oh, I guess farming will be hard as part of this jungle, right? Because you you actually have to kite a bit. All right, how many chests am I missing? Six. I'm missing four chests and two trash cans. Oh, that's not bad. Four chests. What are these tickets for? Oh. They're just buffs. Too many jungle heroes in league. It's because uh, as long as it's a top laner, I feel like you could jungle too, right? Basically, a jungler is an OP top laner. That's an Akron slash. Damn. Has to be a chest here. I also recommended Valorant, but they didn't like Valorant either. You know, Valorant doesn't really have strategy to it other than, oh, who kills each other first. The only strategy is, I guess, predict where to come from. Yeah, map awareness. Trash bag here for a reason, I feel like. I'll get to choose some friends to come over, or right, I'll call Jing Yuan. Oh, he's actually here. Next, a short person. But what? This is not a. Himiko is not short. Call Himiko. Oh wow, she actually came. Okay. Black Swan or Kafka? Kafka! Oh, she didn't answer. Lineups? Oh yeah, there's also lineups, but I don't really care about the lineups. Black Swan. Nice. And then let's have... <coughs> you run May. Oh no. Look from behind? Oh yeah. Not letting me look for me on. Oh, she is sitting. Okay. <laughs> well, where's me? Uh, oh, 
I haven't done this Hanu yet. I forgot. I haven't done this Hanu. And I think these... I don't think there's anything here. I've been here before. I also have to do this thing. Sequel mode? Oh. Okay, this thing is easy. I did it before. The new minigame, yeah. Alright, shoot bullets and switch. Okay, I see. Wait, what? I don't understand. I don't understand, wait. How come... Oh, I can hold it, okay. I did not know. Crap. Crap, wait, that one's hard. Missed out all the points. Oh, holy cow. Right, I have to start messing up or something. What do I have to do? Let me just try my best. Okay, so whenever you shoot at the last second, it gives you invincibility. Doing better than before, at least. Nice. close Oh my god, I almost messed up. Oh no. No, or 16. That, okay, that's pretty nice score. 16k. Oh, I almost made it to 18k, damn. So close. Sequel mode? What about movie mode? Okay, this thing. Target score 2.5. Oh, that's easy. Light work. Moving. 
going so slow. Damn, well they actually give a lot of jades here. Every time we complete one, we get 10 jades. Close. 
We'll get a free ticket too. Wow. Maybe I could hit my standard pity with these. Okay, so the invincibility time is actually longer than I think. Yeah. Easiest game of my life. Why are you making fun of me? I'm doing good. I haven't failed yet. Perfect clears. Still going, beating every single stage. Last one for the tickets. Five thousand. What the heck? I clearly pressed it in time. This game is trolling. Easy clear. I right, got the ticket to finish everything. Oh, they even gave me a call saying that I beat it. Okay, let's see. Five star. I got 97 rolls. Pretty sure there's the other one too. I guess it's clear for more. <clears throat> Alright, 
Alright, so what I have to do is that Hanu thing. It's over here. Oh no, not here. But what even is this? Pretty sure I did this. Too sleepy to type. Probably go to sleep. Is that like 5 a.m.? I'm getting sleepy too. I'm just autopiloting. Crap. How do I beat this? 5:30 a.m. Yeah. I already beat this. I thought there was more to do. Oh yeah, the other side also has one. Forgot. But what? Where is it? There's supposed to be another Hanu thing. What's this? Find twenty origami birds, and you get this free light cone. That light cone is trash, though. I guess I might as well do this puzzle first. <sighs> this guy has something. Oh, never mind. Oh, it's down there. Damn. Stomach hurts. I've been having diarrhea for the past week because I guess the the homemade pizza I made, I probably let the yeast live for a bit too long, causing more fungus to grow. What E2, what does the E2 do for Akron? You don't feel like you're using your brain cell to understand. So, what her E2 does is that you know how whenever you attack something, you get this pedal thing on the monster, it gives an extra pedal, and you also get another stack for your ultimates. And then, not only that, but it also counts towards another nihility on your team. And from your bonus trait, for if uh, if you have one nihility on your team, you do 15% more damage. If you have two nihility on your team, you do 60% more damage. So it's like a 45% increase with that Edelon on. If you already have one, that is. So it counts as two after you get that Edelon. It's uh, it should be 45% because you get 115% damage if you have one the healthy and 160% damage if you have two. So it's like an increase of 45 because I'm pretty sure everyone has at least one the healthy on their team, well, other than me. Because I, I don't have any the healthy on my. But yeah, it's pretty big of a upgrade. Yeah, increases one slash dream and also one crimson knot. 
which is humongous. When this unit's tar turn starts, gains one slash dream. Yeah, that is huge. You gain one free stack by just taking a turn. Normally, you don't even get a stack. You literally get a free stack. <laughs> so, not only are you getting your ultimate faster, but you're also doing so much more damage, too. And you also get an extra Crimson Knot. And the Crimson Knot, I think, uh, wait, let me see what the Crimson Knot does again. Shit, what does it say? Okay, so every time there's uh, three stacks of Crimson Knot, you do additional 24% attack. And you also increase your damage by 15% for every stack of Crimson Knot removed. So that's another 15% more damage. Plus 24% attack. Plus the 45% from the Nihility Trace. Over here. So that's... Yeah, that's a lot more damage. Yeah, 60% in total. And it also increases your rate where you can use your ultimate. So yeah, it's a lot. You don't even know if you should sleep now. You have work at 9. You probably should sleep now. You still got a, I mean, at least 2 hours of sleep if you wake up and brush your teeth and eat. I usually wake up like 30 mi minutes before I go to work. I just quickly brush my teeth and eat like some sort of bread or something. Actually, I don't even want to eat because usually whenever I eat, there's more of a chance that I get a stomach ache. And I do not want to get a stomach ache. This and I get a free chest. <laughs> well, where's the chest at? Hell, I got scammed. Oh. I guess it's down there. <laughs> Middle of the garden, oh. Satisfying. Well, you actually move faster by moving like this, don't you? Never mind, you don't. Neo Akron showcase. Oh my god, dog shit relic. Why do they even give me those? Alright. I'm um, still at 21. That doesn't even count. That chest does not count. I guess I just gotta work on the Hanu thing that's over here. Pretty sure it's somewhere here. Yeah, the spot, I think. <sighs> My back hurts so much for some reason.
Probably because of my chair. I'm moving in one month though. And the uh, condo area has a free gym. So at least I can start working out more. Hopefully there's a pull up bar because I need to work on shoulders more than anything else. What? Or maybe it's there. Let me check here. Puzzles don't count? Oh. I wonder how I'm gonna stream if I move because the place I'm moving to doesn't have a lot of room actually. It's another one of these. Do this later. Maybe I should make cooking videos instead. Because there is a balcony. So I could just cook in the balcony. Maybe I could buy like a portable a portable top uh, fry thing, some sort of top grill, and I could do like mukbangs. That would be fun. Five minute craft videos? I mean, I don't know how to craft anything. <laughs> what is there to craft? I bet there's a secret back here. Oh, there is. How to make a paper airplane or a paper star? <laughs> oh, they already, I already finished collecting them. Oh, never mind, I didn't. Mukbangs are super unhealthy? Nah, I feel like it depends on the person. Of course, if you do a mukbang every day, where you just pour grease and cheese in your mouth, it's bad, but I love you. I definitely can't do that. First of all, I don't even have cheese with that. I don't have an unlimited resource of cheese. Nor do I have eggs. I don't think I ever have eggs. Eggs is like expensive. All I have is flour, so maybe I can make like pasta or something. Or some bread. I could make like banh mi mukbang. For the Vietnamese people. Mukbang of salads? Nah, that's. I guess I could, right? Eat vegetables and make it sound like it's tasty. Types of salad videos. I freaking hate kale. I did not know kale tasted so bad. Like who invented kale? I thought kale was gonna be like lettuce where it's just crunchy and liquidy, but nope it's not. Tastes like trash. As a bitter after I mean as a small bitter aftertaste to it too. Feels like I'm eating grass. Where is the Hanu place? I don't understand. Is that really the only place? I 
I swear there's supposed to be another place. Oh, right here, maybe. You guys actually just dump everything and call it a salad. Yep. Oh, trash can. Everything is a salad. You put eggs with mayo, it's a salad. You put the the fried crab, imitation crab, with some random stuff, it's a crab salad. Wait, what? I didn't even have to battle it. it just gave me the stuff. Alright, 23 out of 27. I just need the treasures now. Can't be that hard. Pretty sure I did this. Yeah, I did this like 10 times. Oh, I see. There's something behind here. rocket launcher at maybe I missed it I definitely did not miss it here And here, and your sister used to prep for 8 to 12 hours cooking on her off days. <laughs> 8 to 12 hours. That's a lot of prep. Why is there something missing here? Oh never mind, I probably already did the puzzle. Okay, I was there just before. I don't understand. There's supposed to be another haunted quest, but I just can't remember where I found it. You like making side dishes? Yeah. Same. I like making anything crisp. As long as it's crispy, it's good. Been here. Uh, where's the Hanu thing? I swear to God, I'm missing something. Sure, I finished here, so it has to be up here. But I also checked up there every single 
corner. Can't be down here, can't be up here. It was always for like 10 people, so you never get yourself never got a refill. I never make food for other people because I always like my food greasy. I forgot I could just pull out my toe pass. But where's that quest? navigation this view Those side quests from the first planet. I, I, th I did most of them except for the Sanjo ones. I kind of skipped the Sanjo ones. I was kind of tilted when it was patch 1.2 or 1.1 because I never got any character I wanted. <laughs> Until patch 1.4 or 5. This is still not done. You need to ask someone to do it for you, or you need to do it between your work hours. Damn, I'm just missing a few chests. 
almost done. I mean, the reason why I'm trying to do every single side quest for Penacani is because if you do everything, they give you those tickets so that uh, we could get more rewards from the clocky statue. Finished it. Wait, did we get anything? Kakabasha. Oh yeah, and also the stickers. Probably completed more of these. Still not done. Wow. Missing two. Oh, it's from the other area of crap. Twenty-four out of twenty-seven. Why is that? Oh, it was right here. No wonder. It was right here. How did I not check the spot? Have you seen that Wei Genshin channel? Wei Genshin channel? I think I've heard of it. Let me see. At least back then, like way, way back then. December 24th, 我不知道是什麼Asian人在做這個Genshin的影片 Birdie here. Do that later. Oh, there's so much people here. Let's pop this. Where's my rocket launcher at? Oh, there's chest right there, oh, okay.
here. Oh crap. It's a rocket launcher. Maybe I should kill those guys first. We should bring Space Greasio to Pankar Star Rail. Yeah, they should add more of the same characters. Oh crap, I definitely can't. One chest down. Okay, one more so I finish. Nice. We already saw Home Moon Star Rail. Space grease you. What's that? Greasio grow up. Hoyoverse has been teasing Greasio's return for a long time. Oh. And they weren't even subtle about it. Many people speculated that she would not count that. That's the moment that Marvin, as Greasio, taught a, a common rule to them. Is she leaves a Her gameplay. Holy cow, the character is pretty nice. Flashes really fast and cuts down a meteor for the old. Basically, like Jing Liu, lightsaber greasy. Her lore is kind of funny, she went to space 50 years ago and she somehow became a Jedi.
shoot, they called me a skilled gamer. But hey, if you're cool and brave enough, trace the truth despite the risk. Okay, that's it. And I finished everything. Nice. And also in the 50k years her whole family dies. Normal Honkai Impact Depression stuff. I wish they had more of that in Star Rail. Okay, I finished absolutely everything in the new area. I'm missing one here and one here. Oh, and this is only the trash can that person. This one, I'm only, oh, I'm also missing only the trash can, okay. So I'm like, good to go. That means if I head back to the clocky, I should be able to claim everything. Nice. They don't even give me- okay, 40 J's, that's kind of funny. Have you listened to Oracle OST? I don't think so. Oracle OST? Carved on Oh yeah, I heard it before. I watched like almost all the trailers now. It was everywhere when Apple released. I guess we kind of have a special story for you too.
Hi Star Wall Walt comes after Air Force Two. <clears throat> I wish I have a limited icon, but I don't. The only limited one I have is probably this one and this one. Are you gonna pull for the cowboy? Uh, probably not. I'm holding for Robin. And if I'm getting Robin, I'm probably getting his, uh, her light cone too. It's either Robin or Venturine. This gameplay looks cool, yeah it does. But it is single target, which I am not a fan of. I already have enough single targets, I just want AoE for Pure Fiction. Pure Fiction is the only thing I ever struggle in. MOC is easy, I can literally auto play MOC now. I want those limited things, especially this one. This one's cute. I want the topaz one. Venturine one's cute too. Lose 50 50 to Himiko? Nah, I'm not gonna lose 50 50. That will not happen. Ten dollars for four rolls, so you get around ten rolls for ten dollars. That is such a scam. For five dollars, you could get ten roll. I mean, twenty rolls. Yeah, five dollars gets you twenty rolls, almost twenty rolls actually, of the monthly. Oh no, not even close to 20 rolls. You only get, uh. Wait, how much is that? 12 or 14 rolls? 3,000 divided by 160. 18 rolls. The Ching Liu one? Oh yeah, that one's pretty good too. I like the Sparkle one. 18 rolls for $5. Battle Pass is. How much is it again? One sixty. I mean, that's sixty eight divided by one sixty. Four rolls. Yeah, a total of eight rolls for ten dollars. This is so not worth it. Eight rolls for ten dollars. I guess you get a lot of these materials though, the Tears of Dreams. That's a lot of stamina saved, I guess. And then for another $10, you get 200, one roll. For another $10, you get one roll and an icon. Holy. That's crazy. Ten dollars for Yeah, but for the bonus thing, right? Doesn't the bonus also the first one already gives you the weapon. But the upgrade one gives you one roll and one icon. <laughs> for ten extra bucks. And also this thing I guess, but I don't even use the other, I don't even use mine, I have almost 50 of them. What's up, Joker Gaming?
I want to get rid of this dumb thing, but I want to. I need to choose. It's gonna be Hanya probably. Hanya or Yukong. Use BP money for energy refresh. You are playing the main story in Honkai Penakani. I finished it just now. Finished everything. I found all the chesses. <coughs> Isn't it cheaper if we just buy from the shop? The energy. I mean, I remember there was those uh, packages. Where is it? Get two. This thing is kind of worth, right? Thirty. Oh, no, never mind. It's not. Refills, EXP, Tears of Dreams. I feel like this is the most worth it because these things are so good. Tears of Dreams versus two fuels. You're sad currently because of the Firefly death. Okay, you're not get. You're not gonna get Emperor. That's sad. Not getting Akron is such a huge loss. Firefly is alive though, yeah. She's alive. And she's gonna be the next character, I mean the... Uh, after the next patch. Can you get her in 50 poles? I could try. I've never gotten a character in under 60, but I feel like I'm just unlucky. I've seen a lot of people get characters underneath those rules, but I still have yet to get them underneath 60. Is this one limited? To oh, wait, no, this one's not limited. This is part of the event. Chef Pom Pom. You got so many characters in Zero Pity. I've never gotten any in Zero Pity. Never in my life. You got 42 Pity, then you definitely have enough if you have 50 poles and 42 Pity for Acheron. Yeah, you probably should go for Acheron. You got E7 Don Hung. <laughs> Damn. I really want the E2. It's so good. It's so powerful. It makes her do so much more. And she already does so much. So imagine being do I mean being able to do so much more.
8% more damage, another 20% more, changes everything to ultimate damage, holy cow. He has so much damage buffs. 48% from the light cone. Plus 36% crit damage. I don't even know why I got Topaz like Cohen. Wasn't even that good. It does apply a debuff though. On S5, it's just broken. Wait, let me see what it does. S5, it basically doubles all the stats. Let's see, where is it? Hility this sixty percent crit damage, eighty percent more ultimate damage. Yeah, that is crazy. You literally are gonna be doing four times the free to play Aquan's damage if you max it out out. Four times the DPS. Oh, what about uh Boot Hills LC? He's Hunt. Boot Hills LC. Oh, Boot Hills a robot. Increases break by 60, break damage by the wearer, ignores 20% defense. When the wearer hits the enemy target, the target receives 1% more damage. Sacks up to 6 times. When hit by the wearer. But that's kind of weak. The hell? That's some weak shit. This is one shitty light cone. <laughs> this is one really shitty light cone. He's a cyborg? Oh yeah, he is. E6 Akron, one slice, yep. Boot Hill's Lycon is so bad. Is there a replacement? That has break? Nope, no replacement. I guess you could use subscribe for more light cone. Yeah, that one's decent, I guess. Yeah, he doesn't even have any good choices, actually. Yeah, then I'm definitely skipping Boot Hill, because I just... I'm not gonna roll for his light cone, and if I'm not rolling for his light cone, it's like... It's no point. I'm not getting his full potential anyways. What does it do? It uh, increases break by 60% and that's the only good thing about it. Uh, what else does it do? Okay, so break effect 60%, break damage ignores 20% of defense. Whenever, okay, whenever you do break damage, it ignores 20% 20 uh, 20 of their defense, which is okay, but it's like not impressive. And this, the passive effect of the light cone is to make the targets receive 1% more damage, up to 6 stacks. It's only effective of the most recent target, so if he switches target, the 1% the stacking removes. So it's like, wow, that's dog shit. 
dog shit unique passive. One percent six times. That's only six percent damage. Yeah, he scales on break effect. You want at least three hundred percent break effect for the for his passive, his uh, bonus abilities to work. And his character itself is pretty OP, but his light cone sucks ass. Cause his character itself, he gets uh. He gets up to 30% free crit rate and 150% free crit damage based on break. So you need a total 300% break damage. And uh, he has a lot of things that ignore defense too. But yeah, I'm not a fan of ignore defense. It just feels like I'd rather have brute force damage than ignore defense. Because if you're ignoring the ignoring defense, it's like, then what about the future units? If the future units apply defense ignore, then that effect is kind of wasted because you're already at full potential. Instead of being able to just get more damage, you just break the fence. His ultimate cost is 120. He does get his ultimate back really fast though. He's good. Yeah, he is... He's really good for a free-to-play player that does go for a light cone. Really, really good. But... Actually, I don't know about light cone because there's just no good 4 star though that has break effect because you really want that break effect from the light cone. And I won't see many options. I guess you just need to put your May in the team and that fixes it. You're waiting to see how they're gonna power creep Acheron? I mean, I'm pretty sure Sam's gonna power creep. If you got Acheron, you would save for Venturine and Firefly. Just not gonna pull for Robin. I'm definitely, I feel like I definitely should get Robin over anything else because Robin is a sub DPS support and that's literally what everyone wants right now, a sub DPS that buffs by an insane amount. You are May level buffing. Offline DPS plus support, yep. Doing damage even without attacking, which is pretty insane. It's not even little too, she's probably going to be doing 100k damage. Every time an ally attacks. I guess I have nothing else to do, so I'm just dinner now. <laughs> Alright, see you guys. And uh, pr probably should sleep for another hour. Alright, thanks for chatting. Bye bye.